Inside the very large eyes of a squid are spherical lenses. Usually, spherical lenses can't bend the light that passes through them enough for the image to look focused, but these cephalopods found a way around that. Their lenses are built up of proteins called S-crystallins. Two loops on the surface of this protein allow it to self-associate into a gel. Slight variations in the protein changes the loops and how they link. The types of links vary in a gradient along the lens, denser in the middle and sparser at the edges. This gradient arises during development. At the larval stage, the proteins are packed together in bundles of six, forming the dense gel core. When particles can no longer diffuse easily through the core, the proteins form a layer with fewer linked S-crystallins on the outside of the core. This continues until the outermost layer, made with just pairs of proteins, which completes the lens. This change in density across the lens allows light that passes through the center of the lens to bend differently than light that falls on the edge, thus focusing what would have been a blurry image. The S-crystallins in squid's lenses act like patchy colloids. These are groups of molecules that exert attractive forces on one another and can form complex shapes out of repeated units, just like the bunches of S-crystalline proteins. With these findings and further research, Scientists think squid lenses could eventually be replicated with simpler materials and used in optical instruments and clinics.